Good day everyone, this is me, Teacher Charmaine Nazaleda, your computer teacher. Our topic for today is all about, all about Windows. Bill Gates is the creator of the famous Windows operating system, the design of which is like a typical window that we have in our homes. When you pick in a specific window, you will see a specific place in the entire area. If you will study its concept, you can pick in an icon by executing a command, either with the use of a keyboard or a mouse device. Once you executed the command, the icon's window will be open. There are different parts of windows. All windows in Windows operating system have common features that you will see as you open an icon. These are the following. Title bar. Resize and plus buttons. Vertical scroll bar. Horizontal scroll bar. And control menu button. Scroll bars are common in all windows. It allows the user to view the other parts of the screen. This happens when the screen has two or more pages to reveal. As illustrated in the picture, the scroll bars are located at the bottom and the right side of a window screen, where a moving bar called elevator is found inside scrolling through a window without a mouse device. On your keyboard, use the arrow or cursor keys by pressing the up and down or right and left arrow keys. You can move through the window screen. On your keyboard, use the page up and page down keys by pressing the page up and page down keys. You can move through the pages one page after the other of a window screen. Icons view. In a window screen of a particular folder icon, you can change the arrangement of your icons. These are the four basic views that you can use from. This view. The window will display the icons with their icon name, found in a specific location or folder. You will also find the number listed of the items on the left lower bottom of the window. Details view. The window will display the icons with their corresponding details like date modified, type, and size of the file. Tiles view. The window will display the icons in a thumbnail size arrangement with their corresponding details like file type and size. Lastly, content view. The window will display the icons in a customized arrangement with their corresponding, corresponding details like date modified, type, and size. If you have any questions regarding our lesson for today, don't hesitate to message me in our LMS. Again, this is Teacher Charmina Zaleda, your computer teacher. Goodbye and God bless.